Hello, my brothers and sisters in Christ. I am finally feeling better. I can mostly breathe through my nose, at least one side. <laughs> Thank you for those who mentioned in the, the community tab that you've been praying for me. It really means a lot to me. And I'm sure that's a big part of why I feel better. For those of you who are new, this is another episode of Piano Hands in which I sing a scripture song I've written. Be sure to check out the hundreds of other scripture songs that I've uploaded here to my channel. You can also find them on iTunes and Spotify and Amazon and all the other music sites. Today I am singing Ephesians 5, 22 to 33. And this is one of those scriptures that, uh, you know, maybe some people don't like. It doesn't seem politically correct. Having wives submit to their husbands and all that. But as I do with all of my scripture songs, I'm unapologetic in representing the Bible just as it is. So here goes. Ephesians chapter 5, verses 22 to 33. Wives, submit to your husbands as to the Lord. Because the husband is the head of the wife, just as Christ is the head of the church. Savior of the body. But as the church submits to Christ, so also wives should submit to their husbands in Just as Christ loved the church and gave himself to send him by her. By cleansing her with the washing of the water by the word. So that he may present the church to himself as glorious without stain or wrinkle or blemish, but holy and same way husbands ought to love their wives as their own bodies just as he loves himself for no one has ever hated his own body but feeds it takes care of as Christ does the church, for we are members of his body. For this reason, a man will leave his father and mother and will be joined to his wife. And the two will become one flesh. This mystery is great, but I am speaking of Christ and the church. Nevertheless, 
as each of you must also love his wife as he loves himself. And the wife must respect her husband. So I think that's kind of neat. It's almost sort of two songs combined in one. And considering the topic, I, I wanted it to sound a little bit like a love song. You know, I have that sort of beauty and melancholy, but with hope. So anyway, I hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you for listening. And if you value this sort of thing, I really ask you to consider becoming a patron and supporting this project. It means a lot to me. It helps me... <laughs> justify it to my wife and but you know it gives me motivation and encouragement that what I'm doing is is the right thing to do and please leave a comment and tell me what you thought make a suggestion for another scripture song God bless you thank you for listening may you glorify him in everything you do see you next time <laughs>